Matt and we were working together at a residential uh, mental health facility. And it was about the craziest place I've ever worked at. And among all that chaos, we initially met and we were friends. He was continuously telling me that he did not want to be in a relationship and I was still trying really hard and that's not something I normally do. Um, the fact that I was willing to make myself vulnerable even though I knew he didn't want to be in a relationship said something that he was kind of important. To me. We started kind of dating and then Holly threw me this amazing birthday party for my 23rd birthday and it was just absolutely incredible. Uh, all my friends were there and everything. And it was just like this way that she totally showed me she loved me and wanted to really do this right. And so from then on we started dating and it wasn't long after that that I told her I loved her and it's been awesome ever since. My favorite thing about Andrew, I can't pick one so I'm gonna pick two. Uh, his sense of humor, he always makes me laugh. As soon as I get in a bad mood, he knows he can get me out of it just by making me laugh. Um, the other thing is that he's always encouraging me and he just believes in me. Whenever I think that I can't do something or I'm done trying, he's there encouraging me and believing in me and telling me that I can do it. So we got engaged um, in Maui, but to start with, the, to lead up to that, um, for several months Holly had been asking if she could go on one of my work trips with me to Hawaii. and. Um, Finally, we were able to do it. Uh, from San Diego, it was a little bit more affordable, so we hopped on a plane. We had an incredible week. First weekend, we went snorkeling and saw sea turtles and um, all sorts of amazing things. We saw whales from a dinner cruise. Like, it was just incredible. And then the next morning, the Sunday morning, I am like, Holly, we have to get up at like 3 in the morning. Um, I'm not going to tell you what's going on, but we're going to go. Um, and she, okay, fine. Um, and so we get up. And um, Holly zombie walks to the to the car and then sleeps the whole car ride up to the bike rental place. <laughs> and then she figures out that we're going to be riding bikes um, down the top of a dormant volcano. Um, and after watching the sunrise, and so the whole ride up, I had my the, the ring in my pocket in the box, and I'm like shaking because I'm so nervous. <laughs> um, it was freezing out there, and we're dressed in like what kind of looks like jumpsuits, like full body jackets to try and keep us warm but it still wasn't warm. Um, so we got out there, we were trying to get a spot on the fence so that we could uh, be right next to it to see the sun coming above the clouds but we didn't quite make it there. Um, the bus driver came over and, and he asked if we wanted a picture and so Andrew was like, oh will you take a video? Which I thought was really weird. I was like, let's just take a picture. <laughs> but I was like, okay. So we took the video, <clears throat> he started recording. As soon as I saw the box, I started crying, of course. <laughs> so I'm sobbing and he uh, he said something really sweet along the lines of um, there's nobody he would rather go swimming with sea turtles with or watching dolphins with and kiss my forehead and then get down on one knee and ask me to marry him. And it was just absolutely incredible. He, it was just beautiful. The, the sun came up right as he was asking and so the, the photos from up there, there's just clouds and sun and it's just so happy and then we had to bike down the hill afterwards so I had the shiny ring on my finger on a speed bike going downhill like how fast I don't know probably like 30 40 miles an hour and I'm expected to pay attention to the road and not look at the ring on my hand and then we spent the rest of the day biking down the mountain and riding our bikes and just kind of celebrating our engagement it was absolutely incredible I am just looking forward to being married to him because it's just gonna be a lifetime of fun. Like, every day is just as exciting, if not more exciting as the day before. It's never, I mean, it's been three and a half years and it's never felt like we're stagnant. We're always doing something fun and exciting and I just, I'm just looking forward to all the wonderful memories we're gonna have and all the wonderful life we're gonna create together. I think just exploring and traveling together is something that we both love so much. And she'd never been west of the Mississippi before we started dating. So to just like have her be excited and send me advertisements for let's go fly to Abu Dhabi is like this incredible thing. Um, I think that's the thing I'm looking forward to the most. Growing old with Andrew is going to be interesting. <laughs> if he is going to be anything like his dad, I am in for quite a treat. I, I think we are going to have such an incredible life together because he is he's just such a wonderful person. He's just so full of love and I, I think 
we are going to have such a wonderful life together. All this feels strange.